Hello everyone, welcome to Pharmacy Practice Mock Test. This is a 10 by 10, that is 10 multiple choice question will be there. You have to attend within 10 minutes. So the rules for these tests are, this is a simple mock test for the government pharmacist exams or any pharmacy competitive exams like GPAT, NIPER, drug inspector or prometric exams. For all of these you can use this mock test. So there will be 10 multiple choice questions. Before starting the question you have to take a paper and pen for writing down the answers. The total questions 10 that I already mentioned. You will get it the 10 minutes for writing the exam. For each right answer, you will get 4 marks. And for the wrong answer, you will get negative 0.3 mark. If you are not attending the question, you will get 0 mark. For the right answer, 4 mark. For the wrong answer, negative 0.3. And for the blank, 0 mark. Total mark will be 40. The procedure for this exam is, first of all, I will read the questions along with the options. Then you will get a 10 seconds to write the answer. After the 10 seconds, I will show the answer. If the answer is right, you will get positive 4 mark. If it is wrong, you will get negative 0.3 and if you didn't attend the question you will get 0 mark. After that if any explanation is there for that question I will explain then I will move to next question this procedure again repeats. After attending full question you have to add up your total marks and just leave a comment on the comment section. Everyone be ready, exam will start after the intro. Hello everyone, welcome to NS Pharma YouTube channel for pharmacists. If you like the video, please make thumbs up and click the subscribe button and bell button for notification. First question. Racinolic acid is present in cascara, shark liver oil, osimum sanctum, castor oil. It's uh, time to write the answer. The correct answer is castor oil. Castor oil is used as mild purgative. Castor oil use is purgative. Next question. Question number 2. An enzyme inducer. Options. Chloramphenicol, Zidovudin, Tetracycline, Rifampicin. Write it down your answers. The correct answer is rifampicin. Rifampicin is an enzyme inducer. Enzyme inducers are griseofulvin, phenytoin, rifampicin. Then smoking is also causes enzyme inducing action, carbamazepine and phenobarbitone. This thing we can study using the formula GPRS cell phone G for griseofulvin. P for phenytoin, R for rifampicin, S for smoking, C for carbamazepine, P for phenobarbitone. Next question, question number 3. Book of secondary entry. Options, trial balance, journal, ledger, balance sheet. It's time to write answer.
correct answer is ledger ledger is a secondary entry book question number 4 an organo sulfur compound stored in mesna sodium gluconate l asparaginase correct answer is mesna mesna is organo sulfur compound this is the structure of mesna you can see sulfur group in organic compound that is organo sulfur compound question number 5 antidote of insulin overdose antidote of insulin overdose glucagon glycogen glucose fructose correct answer is glucose antidote for insulin overdose is glucose question number six the latin word oris tilla means the latin word oris tilla means drops ear drops eye drops nasal drop Correct answer is ear drop. Oristilla means ear drop. Question number 7. Bacillary dysentery is usually caused by. Bacillary dysentery is usually caused by. E. coli, Shigella, Pastorella, Aeroginosa. Correct answer is Shigella. Shigella causes bacillary dysentery. Next question. Question number 8. Select the antibiotic which has high therapeutic index. Select the antibiotic which has high therapeutic index. Streptomycin, doxycycline, cephalexin, vancomycin. Correct answer is cephalexin. Cephalexin has high therapeutic index. For finding out therapeutic index, you can use the formula LD50 by ED50 or TD50 by ED50. That is median lethal dose divided by median effective dose. Larger the therapeutic index, the safer the drug. If therapeutic index is larger, the drug will be more safer. Next question, question number 9. Monophasic liquids are, monophasic liquids are colloidal solution, suspensions, emulsions, all of the above. Correct answer is colloidal solution. Last question. Application for grant of a license to sell, stock, exhibit or offer for a sale or distribute drugs other than those specified in Schedule X. Application form number for the drugs other than those specified in Schedule X. Options form number 19, form number 20B, form number 20G, form number 20. Correct answer is form number 19. This is the form number for different class of drugs. You can see in the first column that is different classes. 
second column form number for wholesale the third column form number for retail sale as per the homeopathic medicine uh, form number used is 20c for retail sale as well as 20d for wholesale sale for drugs which are other than those specified in schedule c c1 and x form number 20 for retail sale 20b for wholesale drugs which are specified in schedule x 20f for retail 20g for wholesale uh, for getting license the form number used for the drugs which are specified in schedule c and c1 and I, which are excluding x for retail 21 for wholesale 21b with a motor vehicle which is specified in schedule c and c1 and x 20bb for wholesale specified in schedule c and c1 excluding x using motor vehicle is 21bb for wholesale thank you guys for watching this video and don't forget to write your mark in the comment section right now itself and also subscribe my channel ns pharma and press the bell button for getting the notification thank you